new Pokemon reveal. Let's see what it has to say. So, investigating into a newly discovered Pokemon underway, mysterious coins have begun to appear, and along with them, the Pokemon Gimme Gold. Oh, Gimme Gold! Oh my god, its name is literally Gimme Gold. Okay, so Gimme Gold, Google, Gimme Gold, Gimme Gold. It appears that Professor Willow and Mr. Shack uh, are investigating this Pokemon and the many mysteries that still surround it. Um, oh my lord, it's literally in the chest. Gimme, uh, so Gimme Ghoul has a chest form. The coin chest Pokemon, all right. Um, type is ghost type, so it's a pure ghost type. That's interesting, because I thought it was supposed to be a ghost steel type. So that's a bit different than I expected, I'm not gonna lie. That's a bit different than I thought. But uh, either way, its ability, ability is rattled. So it's literally inside of the chest. It's literally in the actual chest, which is so freaking cool, man. Uh, but there is the regular form, so the roaming form. Uh, we don't know the typing of this one. Interesting. And I guess we can play the video here, which apparently is private still. Wait, that's still private. Interesting. They haven't even unprivated it yet. Okay, so we're going to have to wait a bit until that video is available. Uh, unless we can play this video. No, it's literally private still, guys. Uh, I'm going to refresh the website real quick. Um, private video. Yeah, that's a bit annoying. I guess we don't really, we can't really check it yet. Huh. Well, at least we know what it looks like now. It's literally inside the chest. That is really weird. So, gimme ghoul. Literally, gimme gold. Huh. It's literally inside the chest. But I don't get it. What's the point of the chest then? So, as they describe it here, it appears that Professor Willow are investigating it. Okay, along with them, the Pokemon gimme ghoul. So, mysterious coins. But what? I don't get it. So Gimme Ghoul is the Pokemon itself. But then this is its chest form. So the roaming form and then the chest form. And as far as I understand it is, you have to collect multiple of them to be able to get it. But the, the video is still private. Uh, Japanese is already out. Uh, if you guys can link it to me, that would be very appreciated. Uh, oh, here it is. Okay, here we go. Here we go, lads. We got the, we got the Japanese trailer. Uh, we got the Japanese trailer. Let's see what they have to show. So... Here we go, lads. Let's see. Give me ghoul. Let me see the lad. Well, also, let's make sure we've got this in high 1080p quality. All right. Oh, this is a new area, by the way. Look, this is a new zone. And Lycanroc. I just saw Lycanroc. We got Pyro and whatnot as well. I uh, got Lycanroc over there. Um, and there's the chest. Okay, so we know that these are supposed to be collected, right? Okay, there it is. So you can find them in the wild, apparently, in their chest form. You don't actually have to collect them to get the chest version. Uh, you can just get them like this too in the wild. You don't actually have to collect the mini versions for this, uh, as far as I'm aware. Ooh, what was that? Wait, what was that move? Was that ancient rock or what was that? Uh, there's a little one. See him? They're tiny, dude. They're literally like Meltan. They're just like Meltan to me. They just feel like this small version. Also, it looks so weird. Never would have thought that would be a real Pokemon. That is so strange. And then it's just the bonus information at the end. Okay, let's go back through this. All right, let's see anything we may have missed here. Let's see anything we may have missed. So initially, okay, we know that we have Pyro and them, Litleo, etc., whatever. Uh, we have them, Lycanroc over there. So that's, I don't know if it's already been confirmed or not. Um, so you can find them as a chest in Ancient Rock. I don't know. I don't really know what it was. Um, power, power Gem. Thank you. That was the move. I I don't remember all the all the Power Gem. Um, there we go. Okay, so, so it's literally just inside the chest. Now, as far as I know from the leaks, when it's in this form, this is supposed to be, I guess, the final form, right? Or something like that. But you can catch it like this, or you can collect the mini versions, right? You can collect the mini versions to get this version, which is really weird, because that's what the Riddler said to us. Um, that's what I understood from the Riddler. Well, they don't really explain a lot here either. Well, we got Sableye, which I think we already knew was in the game. I don't think that's anything new. Again, new zone here. Kind of like a ruined castle almost, like ruins. I don't really know where on the map that would be exactly. Um, my guy is literally just chilling in the chest, loving his little gold. He's a little, it's literally a goblin. He's a little goblin, dude. Oh my lord, he's a literally a little goblin. It's a straight up little goblin, man. What the heck? All right, let's go back and let's check the English trailer now that it's out. Let's see, see if the English version has anything new that we didn't already see. Uh, and Tiger Wolf, thanks for the five donation. Yes, we're looking at the English version right now. So again, the same information we've kind of already seen. Um, nothing, out of, oops, wait, sorry. It just stopped playing literally for a second, guys. Give me a, give me a minute. Uh, here we go. Ruffled go. English video is up now. Yes, sir, I'm on it. We're watching it. It seems to have the same, same stuff though. 
I don't really think there's, that we're missing anything here. It's still the same info, it seems like. Yeah, okay, let me see what it says. So, uh, a new Pokemon discovered. Uh, Gimme Ghoul, the, the chest form, which is a ghost type. Oh, what typing is the other one, though? They don't mention the typing of the mini version, though. That's a bit strange, isn't it? Or, do, wait, is there another evolution to this? Because I don't really remember. Is there another evolution to this? Because that's the small one. I mean, look at how tiny he is. He's so small, man. He's so small. Click the link, my boy. Thank you. Thank you, y'all. appreciate it. Uh, so they don't show the typing of this one. Interesting. So I guess it's not even a Pokemon. Is the small version not even a Pokemon? Like, does it even count as a Pokemon? Or is it just literally almost like an item, almost, right? Hmm. So I think the chest... I think Gimme Ghoul's uh, chest form can evolve into something else, right? And there is an easy way to figure this out. If we go over to Machio and J. Rose's website, if we go right here and you look at, like, um... You look at, like, the information we have. If we go down here and we find the coin Pokemon. Uh, let me see. Coin. Or has that been updated already? Uh, oops, that's... Um, Oops, no, wait, there we go. Uh, let's find the coin Pokemon. Where's the coin Pokemon? Oh, here it is. So we know about this lad right here. Um, that's the, the Gimme Ghoul that we've already seen. But what do we know about it? So apparently the coin Pokemon, it's hard to get it. Imagine Spirit Tomb and PLA. To evolve it, you have to get very uh, a very large amount of coins. You can catch it. Uh, wait, you can, wait, you can catch it? It's not really a coin, just a code name. Okay. Huh. Okay, but then there's also the evolution, which is supposed to be, we're told it's supposed to be a ghost steel type. It evolves in a golden Ningen, liquid metal. To evolve it, you have to get a very large amount of coins. You can catch the first stage to get 10 to 15 coins instead of one plus this Pokemon is, wait, wait, plus one. This Pokemon is OP with a powerful new ability and a crazy high power signature move without any negative effect. The move is 5 PP, 140 to 150 base power. I think they nerfed that though, as far as I'm aware. Uh, check the other video. Okay, let me see, what's the other video? Um, let me get this other video up real quick. Um, here we go. Let's see. Let's watch this. It's a five-minute video. Let's see what it has to say. Let's see. Okay. Here we go, lads. Pokemon Go and Pokemon Scarlet hey, Violet. Jock. Thanks for sending me that video. I think this might just be the Pokemon I've been hearing so much about. Trainers from all over have reported sightings. Uh, I've got to say, Professor, I'm surprised Gimme Ghoul's showing up in your neck of the woods. Gimme Ghoul. So that's what this Pokemon's called. Could the treasure chest it hides in actually be part of its body? It also carries the same type of coin trainers have been finding. That's right. In Paldea, I've seen some Gimme Ghoul that hide in treasure chests, and some that don't. Hmm. So it's the same Pokemon, it's just in two different forms. Are new to me. Hmm. The fascinating part is, as far as I know, no one's ever caught a Gimme Ghoul that's not in a chest. The second you get near, they hightail it out of there, dropping a coin as they flee. Oh, okay. I don't think we've seen them act like that over here. Hmm. You know, there's actually an interesting story about Gimme Ghoul and its coins. Okay. Here's an old, strange tale involving Ooh. a mysterious coin. It's a sick. Once upon a time, a young girl was out on a walk when she picked up a coin. Mm -hmm. Clink. There's another, said the girl. Wait, what's that? Mm -hmm. When the mysterious being noticed the girl, it fled through a nearby door. The girl hurriedly chased after it and came upon a treasure chest. Okay. But the mysterious being lurked nearby staring intently at the girl hmm. the treasure chest opened quietly and whatever was inside met the girl's gaze the girl put a coin into the treasure chest one she picked up another coin and put it into the chest yeah two once again she picked up a coin hmm. and put it into the chest three All right. Eventually, the chest came to be full of coins. Okay. 997, 998, 
evolution? Evolve? Is it gonna evolve? Uh oh. Huh? What am I doing with all these coins? The girl wondered. Hmm. Now who or what had been so intent on gathering them? Interesting. What an intriguing tale. It might help us mm. learn more about this Pokemon. I hope so. It seems to suggest that Gimme Ghoul hiding in treasure chests don't move on their own. They just okay. manipulate people into gathering coins for them. On the other hand, Gimme Ghoul mm. without treasure chests don't seem to manipulate people. Perhaps they're able to go searching on their own. They use the it's antenna. It's odd for Pokemon of the same species to behave so differently, don't you think? Mm. Since they're behaving so differently, Maybe we ought to consider them separate forms. What do you think? Okay, Should interesting. We name them? Good idea. Let's see. Chest form seems fair for the one that hides in chests. <laughs> yeah. It's very straightforward. As for the one that walks around, how about roaming form? <laughs> fair enough. I like it. So you've never heard of anyone catching a roaming form gimme ghoul in Paldea, right? Hmm. Yep. But out where you are, they don't run away? You said they just tag along near people who've picked up coins. Right. If trainers out here use that behavior to their advantage, they might be able to catch it. What an exciting research opportunity. Hmm. Is there anything else you can tell me about Gimme Ghoul? I'd be happy to tell you everything I know, and I'll do what I can to help you catch roaming form Gimme Ghoul. Thank you. And I'm sure trainers will also appreciate your help. Now, about those coins. Uh, whoops. There's the bell. Time for class. Sorry, professor. Gotta run. All right. Before you go. Uh, oh, well, that's Jacques for you. Always dancing to the beat of his own drum. <laughs> I ought to send him a thank you gift for his help with Gimme Ghoul. Maybe a nice postcard. <laughs> oh, my lord. All right. Well, there you go. So then basically what we know now, this pretty much confirms it, right? Ladies and gentlemen, that Gimme Ghoul is two different it's just a, it's a singular pokemon there's the same pokemon it's just two different forms they're just two different forms that's pretty much what i'm taking away from this they're the same pokemon just two different forms and hmm let me think about it so they're the same pokemon two different forms and there is an evolution once you get a thousand coins but basically if you if you get a coin from a singular uh gimme ghoul a singular gimme ghoul gives you one coin. The chest gives you between 30 to 40 coins instead, or 30 to 50 according to the leaks, right? That's what we understand. It's kind of like Mel Metal a bit, yeah. Hmm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Well, I don't know, man. It's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. And uh, yo, thank you so much, my guy. Uh, Aileen Lumina, thanks for being a member for six months. Much love, been a while. I uh, love the new little guy. Yeah, a lot of people seem to really like uh, Gimme Ghoul. A lot of people seem to really, really like Gimme Ghoul. Um, and here it is, Gimme Ghoul chest form. It's on the website right now. Uh, if you go here, it literally just says the same information we just read. Uh, but you can also get it in Pokemon Go, of course. But yeah, there's definitely going to be an evolution for this. It's a ghost type, and I guess its evolution is a ghost steel type, right? And it has two different forms. Uh, it's just a singular Pokemon, but it has two different forms. The chest form, which is kind of the main form, that gives you like 30 to, uh, 30 to 50 coins at once. And then there is the other version, which is like a roaming one, a tiny version that just drop coin, drops coins, which you can't actually capture, but you can only really find it in the wild. So yeah, uh, interesting. I think it's really sick, man. It's a cool new Pokemon. It's a unique ID. I didn't really like the, the basic version of it because I just thought it was a bit goofy and weird, but I do like it in the chest. I think it's, uh, it's pretty, I don't know. I mean, look, look at him. He's just like, give me the gold. Give me the gold! Give the goblin some gold! Yes, but ladies and gentlemen, uh, that is for you who are watching this in video form. That's gonna be it for the video. That's gonna be it for the breakdown. That's all the information that was provided. Uh, and everybody live stream, you guys can keep watching. We're gonna keep going for a little bit. But yeah, that's it for the video, guys. Thank you for watching.